Hi, and welcome back. In case you missed it last week, on May 6, BC Book Prize nominee Janie Chang was invited to the White Rock Public Library to share in a reading and to discuss her debut novel, Three Souls. If you follow me on Twitter, you'll know that for a month leading up to this, I'd been madly sharing this link for this event. And if you did miss it, this debut author did a wonderful job reading from her novel to a full house. After answering many questions about her novel, her writing process, and inspiration, Janie took the time to sign her books for her many new fans. She also thanked me for attending, and she really appreciated how much I tried to get the word out, even featuring her on my All Kinds of Writing blog. I told her that she had no idea how many authors I screen, reading excerpts from their works before I decide to extend an invitation. Her debut novel more than measured up. From the first page, she grabs you and propels you through an artfully written story about the protagonist's life, the afterlife, and the meaning of unconditional love. It is a beautiful, haunting historical fiction with a supernatural element. The central character, whose name is Leyin, is my grandmother. Of course, this is a heavily fictionalized character. I'm pretty sure my grandmother didn't get up to the wild escapades that this protagonist did. but. I think it's something that my grandmother might have done if she'd been younger and more foolhardy. But I don't want to give away any spoilers. Just pick up three souls from your local library or bookstore and enjoy this read. I hope you join me again, and until next week, please follow Janie on Twitter as she starts on her next novel, and take a moment to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.